Hi, welcome back on this video. Let's imagine for today that we, you are a beginner in styles. You don't know where to enter, how to do it. And let's see three methods of opening styles. First is on sidebar on the right with styles. Go here, select the text you want to change and double click the style you want. So this is the first method. Let's see the second one. Um, I can go to styles and manage styles. It's the same um, sidebar. Okay. And the same, we select the text and double click and I can change everything to that style. Let's see the third method. Press F11. F11, I opening, closing, F11, opening and so on. So the same, I can select the text, double click here, pressing F11 and have more space for changing. If I want back F11 and uh, changing again to paragraph F11 and I close everything. Let's open again F11 and now let's see here what tools we have. We have six here in the top, paragraph style, character style, frame styles, page styles, list styles and table styles. So we have different for each options. Uh, in general, all the uh, text in the document is a paragraph. So most of these styles are applying to um, paragraph as I, we seen. Character styles we have seen in the previous video with um, that red text. And let's talk about something else now. Let's uh, create a new style. How to create a new style? Our style. Let's write some text here. And let's select it. Let's uh, change how we want it. Let's bold italic center let's remove the point the dot here and we want this kind of text this style to be our style we go here and from here we choose new style from selection okay let's rename it selection bold okay so now I have this style. If I want, for example, um, let's see, we have here in the top, we have a filter. What to see? We can see with custom, we can see just the styles we created. Let's select this paragraph and double click here. We have the same style here and here, bold, italic and centered. Let's see again double click very easy to change let's go again select all paragraph everything is back to normal very easy to use uh, these styles let's see again okay so just need to select and avoid using this toolbar when using styles this is manual formatting and this is style formatting so when using one kind of uh, formatting, avoid using uh, another one. One option here is to show preview. For example, you can see here it's a normal text and uh, all the styles I can see here uh, with simple text, but I can see what they are doing. If I check that, I can see, for example, if I click here, will be bold, and italic and with this size. So it's very easy to see what the result will be. So I prefer with that checked. Hidden styles uh, are styles that are hidden, okay, of course. For example, I can select all text except the styles I want to use. Um, chapter and uh, Let's find what I use paragraph and let's see more. I want, I want, I want default. 
let's search for default default is here and now hide we I've hidden everything except the style I use so now I can see very easy uh, I have hidden styles and uh, with all I have uh, all styles all style that I that are shown that are not hidden so now I have these uh, short uh, options with a few styles that I can use very easy you can see very easy I can change from one side style to another and no problem in um, the aspect of the text let's see more about that custom styles are styles that I use in the document automatic uh, let's go to Haydn first because we are we don't have many styles because they are hidden let's unhide them so let's go to hidden styles select all and show and now we can see chapter styles list styles special styles HTML styles conditional styles okay all styles so depending what you want you can choose these filters as you please thanks for watching and please subscribe for more video thank you